Sheridan Smith is said to be lucky to be alive following her horror crash last week during Storm Arwen. The actress and singer was in the accident last week as she lost control of her Range Rover and drove into a tree after slipping on the ice. The 40-year-old was close to her Essex home when she was said to be in the car with her boyfriend Alex Lawler. The Sun reported that she made it out of the crash with cuts and bruises. The tree had severe damage especially to the top branches which suggested that the car could have been in the air as it hit the tree. It's thought that the crash happened just before an episode of the Jonathan Ross show on ITV where Sheridan appeared. A neighbor said, Sheridan is so lucky to be alive. It could have been so much worse. Her car was stuck in the tree, it was a really bad crash. It could have been so much worse, she had cuts and bruises, but it could have been fatal, she was incredibly lucky. It was a brand new Range Rover, she hasn't had it long. It's almost a miracle she's not hurt herself more. It's an incredibly tight bend to take at the best of times, never mind in a freezing storm like Harwen. For the car to be actually stuck in the tree it must have been traveling with some force. She managed to get back to the house then someone called the cops. But thank goodness there were landowners to cut up the tree blocking the road or police would never have got through. It doesn't bear thinking about what might have happened. Essex police confirmed that they spoke to Sheridan and Alex confirming there were no other drivers involved and that no crimes were committed. While Sheridan was at the Jonathan Ross show she reportedly feel out with the backstage staff accusing them of being sexist. However it was confirmed that it wasn't Jonathan himself who upset the star. A spokesperson for Jonathan Ross told the publication, Sheridan seemed to have a great time on the show but appeared to become upset afterwards. Jonathan asked her if she was okay and she said, don't worry, it's not you. So Jonathan assumed it was a personal matter between Sheridan and the group of people she'd come with. We will investigate immediately. I hope Sheridan knows we would never take a claim of this kind lightly. However it was reported that Sheridan was absolutely fuming saying the atmosphere was chauvinistic. A source told The Sun, Sheridan was absolutely furious when filming on Jonathan Ross had ended. She claimed the atmosphere was chauvinistic and there was an air of misogyny. She also claimed that she felt she had not been treated with kindness. Sheridan was apparently seen shouting at the team and threatened to sack them.